Howdy folks, we're gonna try some Delectables Bisque, that lickable treat with tuna and shrimp. Bisque is of course a finely pureed type of soup, um, often not even pureed. Like a lobster bisque, they will um, boil the, the carcasses. You know, you don't have lobster meat in it or anything like that because that's just really expensive. It's, it's a bisque, it's, it's uh, not a chowder or a stew. Anyways, this is a bisque, it's a tuna and shrimp bisque. And Archie's not up here yet, but he wants it, I think. Let's get it open. Let's get it poured out. Let's see if the cat wants to try the bisque. Oh, well, it pours out quite gross. Okay. Let's glop it out. That's a nice, thick, goopy mess for him if he's interested. We'll see. Um doesn't have the same stench as the others, but it doesn't look like barf either. No, it just looks like poop. So, there's that. Archie, come on. Okay. He was fighting coming up here for some reason. Oh, now he sees it. Jesus. <laughs> right to it. Wasn't even gonna let me tell you about it. You just you gotta eat it now, huh? Look at that. The guy is destroying it. <clears throat> what a good boy, huh? Is this a good treat for Archie? He is gonna get out of town on this one. Uh, let's see, we haven't uh had much more to say. I'm surprised that he likes any of these. And he loves every one of these. Let's see if I can get him to look up here a little bit. Hey, Archie. <laughs> no chance. Let's see if I can do that with this. Hey, Archie. Coming down to see you. Arch, Arch. No, he's just going to eat his, his food and not look up. Because why? He's got this delicious tuna and shrimp bisque. Go to town, Arch. Go to town. He's got a good guy. So, yeah, I don't know if you saw an older video of, of him. Not of him. He wasn't in it. I talked about him. I went to Circus Circus, <coughs> and I bought a, uh, or I played a crane game with one little squishy elf that I thought he might like as a gift. I brought it home, and I tossed it to him. Sure enough, he picked it up, because he will. If you toss something to him, he picks it up, at least to see what it is. Picked it up, ran off into a corner of the kitchen, and set it down. And that's where it sat for about a week, in the corner of the kitchen. And I just looked at it and said, Oh, Arch, if you're not going to play with this, I'm going to put it on my desk and have a little squishy toy that I can, you know, stress ball type, and it'll look like a lace elf on my desk for Christmas. I can have a Christmas decoration. So I went and got it, and I put it on the desk, and within five minutes, he jumped up, grabbed it in his mouth, Ran away with it and hit it somewhere. I don't know where it is now. Like Dank said, it's because Archie doesn't want the elf telling me what he's done to it. I think that's it. You ate it all. Let's see. Yeah, so that was just an Archie story. Uh, and he just, as he devoured that food, and he gives it a... What do you have? Are those thumbs? They're little nub things, aren't they? A little toe bean up. One toe bean up. The thumb one, that one, that, that toe bean. <clears throat> so yeah, that's a that's an Archie story, and there he goes. Maybe he'll look up at us. Be a good boy. No, he's just he's he's going to be a member of the Clean Plate Club. Are you a member of the Clean Plate Club, Archie? Yeah, he's going for it. Oh, there's a little piece there. You get that little button for being a member of the Clean Paint Plate Club. Oh, God, I can't even say it. Oh, it's looking at things. Hey, Archie. Scratch his tail area. He likes that. So there we go. Archie really likes these delectables. Um, he doesn't like much of anything, so... If you've got a finicky cat, this might be a good treat. I don't know, because he's a finicky guy, and these are incredible to him. 
Well, thanks for joining me and Archie. Uh, please like and dislike and do what you're going to do. Comment if you want. And please, please subscribe. Thanks a lot, folks. Talk to you later.